A difficult loss um, to Vancouver. Yeah. So how do you kind of take that and you know translate it into having good performance this weekend? Yeah, I think uh, we've we've looked at it and, and saw the positives out of it, and uh, you know we played you know we played very well you know up until the last couple of minutes and uh, a mistake obviously, but I think you know we can take the positives out of it, and if, uh, if we keep playing like that all season, we'll definitely win more games than we lose. Are there any positives in particular that really stick out for you? Was there anything? Uh, else yeah, specific? I mean the possession, the attacking side of it, every uh, the movement of the, of the boys, and uh, you know especially sitting from the back and watching them. You know we worked really well together and uh, the interaction. So uh, you know maybe it's just that little final little bit that we need to uh, get right. But you know the more season goes on, we'll, we'll definitely get it right. Uh, you look at that that mistake, obviously. Uh, do you, you think it's just like an isolated incident, and you and Nat are just going to yeah. I mean, yeah. I mean, we work on it every day in training, work playing together, and working together, and it's just one of the freak things that um, that happened. And you know, we both somehow dummied it, and and uh, you know, Rob Earnshaw got in and scored. But you know, it's something that we uh, won't be letting happen again. And uh, you know, we've got to crack down on that. Dallas has uh, a fair number of uh, pretty talented attacking players. Uh, yeah. Who, who do you need to key on for this game, and what do you need to do to shut them down? I think every week everyone's got a fair amount of a good attacking players. I think every <laughs> every week I'm answering the question how good the their centre forwards are and their wingers are, and then you know I answer it the same week every every time. You know, there's good centre forwards and good wingers in every team, and uh, you know we just got to make sure we, we keep playing the way we're playing and um, you know keep defending. Uh, you know, obviously for that one mistake, but keep going up where, as we have as a, a team, and um, you know, like I said, we'll win more games than we lose. With uh, two of the games that you've dropped points this year have been on really late goals. Um, yeah. Obviously teams are pushing at the mm. end of games, but do you feel like there's something you need to do a little better to be defensively at the end of games? Well, I mean, it's obviously the concentration. We've got to keep concentrating to the final whistle. And, uh, you know, we're doing that every game, but I mean, you know, a couple of times has happened now. So, you know, we've worked on it and we've talked about it and, um, you know, we've got to make sure we cut them out and, uh, you know, try and take maximum points when we can. Given the past results, how important are the next two home games? Yeah, I mean, every game at home is very important to us. You know, we want to try and get maximum points out of all our home games. I think every team's like that in the league. And, uh, you know, more important for us, obviously, going to these two games. But, you know, we'll be approaching the same as we have been every every game to try and win it and, uh, and get three points.